Hey everyone, it's Kristen with Remax. I am reading through the real estate magazine this month by RIS Media, and I want to share a few positive things with you as far as our current state and economy and kind of um, it leaves a positive outlook. So just a few stats here. Um, the builder confidence level for April was 63. In March, it was 62, so just a little bit more confident than the month before. Um, but basically, it says that at 51 or higher, that that is considered a, um, a positive outlook for the builders. Um, also, this is really, really cool stuff here. Um, so back when the market crashed, the mortgage crisis of 2008, it was a really, um, I would say, really tough time for a lot of people. And um, currently, of the 2.8 million homeowners who had or experienced foreclosures, short sales, or bankruptcies, those actually have been dropping off their credit reports between January of 2016 and November of 2018. 11.5% um, of them have obtained a new mortgage and 53% of that of those numbers they um, now have prime or super prime credit scores which I actually had to google that because I wasn't quite sure what that was um, so Experian considers a 680 to 739 a, a prime credit score and 740 or above is considered super prime so that is phenomenal and it shows that a lot of people are recovering um, and there's still a lot of people obviously still recovering. So, um, and then something else, which I thought was interesting was our generation Z. So people between the ages of 18 and 23 are proving to be highly motivated toward home ownership, which is a really good thing. I don't think us millennials really were at that point. Um, so according to the report, 59% of Gen Zers plan to buy a home within the next five years and more than half already started saving. How cool is that? All right. I just wanted to share that with you. I hope you have a great Tuesday and we'll talk soon.